Hello everybody, my name is Shooter101 and welcome to YouTube. Hi. Yeah, no, I didn't get banned, by the way. I haven't been banned twice. I just, uh, I've been really busy recently, so I have science, for instance. I, I've been doing a lot of science homework. Uh, I also just recently started learning C++, coding language, for those of you who don't know. I've decided that I'm going to, hopefully it goes well, I've decided I'm going to be, uh, following my dream, one of my dreams, I have many, um, I'm going to be following my career for video game developer slash designer. Um, the reason for this is is because I, I had a very serious talk with my dad. Uh, my original dream was to be a chef, so in a food truck, stuff like that, um, or, or in a restaurant or something of my own. Uh, and we, we had a long talk about it, and we realized that no matter really what happens, if I move to the United States or if I stay here in uh, China, I... The, the restaurant market is kind of saturated already, so I it would be really, really, really difficult for me to break into that market. Um, the other thing is is I'm, I do painting, for instance, so uh, like I, I paint houses, but essentially is what, what my trade was, um, and technically is. I have more experience in that than anything else. Uh, I also used to do landscaping work and construction work, so all very difficult things to do. Um, and thanks to COVID, I'm going to blame COVID and also my overindulgence of snacks because I do have one. Um, I get, I put on a lot of COVID weight. Um, however, I have recently started working out. I'm drinking a lot more fluids, and uh, I think I'm going to start intermittent uh, intermittent. I'm going to start fasting. <laughs> Um, the, the fasting where you don't eat breakfast or lunch. I'm going to start doing that as well as, uh, working out. And since it's actually a warmish day today, I might go on a walk. Not going to lie. I might go on a walk. Um, because walking is healthy and I might actually start doing that more often where I do walks, where I, I do push-ups, where I just, because honestly, like I... I'm not going to lie, I, I think most of you have noticed, I put on some weight from COVID. I haven't gained, like, a lot of weight, I, primarily mostly in my face and my stomach area. Um, and anyway, so I, I plan on trying to burn off as much weight as possible, trying to get back into uh, a better shape. So, yeah, I've been drinking a lot more fluids. Granted, I should be drinking even more water than I already am, but I'm, I've decided I'm going to drink more water. Um... I'm going to be doing, like, I, I work out pretty much every single night, as provided I'm not super sore or anything. I work out pretty much every single night, so that includes multiple push-ups, squats, um, list of things. I, I do multiple things. I do sit-ups. I do um, a bunch of things. So, with that being said, that's going to kind of, hopefully, I'll be able to stick to that. Uh, but, yeah, so, essentially, for the next... Who knows how long I'm going to be working mostly on myself. Um, I want to get back in shape. I severely lost it, especially since I've done a year without working, essentially, um, because I just couldn't. Well, now, at least where I am, it's open again, so I can do things. I can go to places, um, or I can just flat out walk around, see my friends, do all that kind of stuff. So hopefully, hopefully, this will stay the same. Because I'm sick and tired of fucking mandates. They don't do anything. <laughs> they have done nothing but bad things for people so far. So. Anyway. Um, that's an opinion. That's not misinformation. Uh, it's also fact. But whatever. We're not gonna. Anyway. So. Uh, <laughs> so yeah. It's gonna be very interesting. I think the next couple of. I want to say weeks, but I I really don't know. So yeah, I, I plan on starting to go on more walks. I plan on doing more workouts, more intense workouts as I build up that muscle again and start losing the fat. I, I plan on doing lots of these things. I have some form of exercise plan. It's a, it's a little bit difficult to get into. Not because, well, first off, I don't have the motivation. I'm always tired. But with that being said, exercise should... Um, kick back up that uh, that energy again. Plus, and this is a big thing, um, I actually need to charge my earbuds, my wireless 
well, they're not earbuds, but the my wireless headset for walks and things again. Um, but with all of that being said, um, I will. I, I plan on getting outdoors more, and and for the major reason of first off, it's good for a bunch of health factors. So I get more vitamin D that way, um, which is great for the immune system, and then also I get exposed once again to real life, which will also help my immune system. Um, so yeah, I plan on going on as many walks as possible. Who knows? Maybe I'll even record them. Not likely. I don't expect me to start recording my town. Uh, <laughs> no, I, I, will, I will most likely not be recording at all on my walks. I'm not a walking channel. I'm a gaming channel. Uh, I, I guess... So here's the thing. I... For those of you who don't know, I've gotten into F1 racing majorly. Um, I've put in shit tons of practice. I've gotten significantly better. One problem, I don't have a steering wheel. Uh, my second problem is, is that, um, I don't know how to get faster than I already am. Primarily because I've talked to many people about this because without a steering wheel, I can't feel how the car really works. So changing the setup really only fixes how it looks and which granted is, is also a good thing, but like, it's just really complicated. So with that being said, anyway, uh, it, it's a lot of work, a lot of practice. I've put in like, I don't know. I put in a lot of practice. I have done two, two full like, uh, topics for coding so far. So I know what all of the basics are. So, well, I know what majority of the basics are. Um, I think the next thing I'm doing is talking about integers, which I already know what integers are. Like, I already knew what 90% of this stuff was. For instance, um, creating a project, I know um, how to do that. That's That was an easy thing. Debugging a program, I now know how to do that fully. Um, examining a build log, stuff like that. That's the stuff I learned in the first um, topic. And in this one, I learned about variables and identifiers, except I already know most of them because I did do Unreal Engine coding, and by coding I mean I did blueprints, and since it runs off of C++ anyway, I knew what my majority of it is. So uh, I know what a Boolean is, which I just uh, watched a video on, I know what a character is, and I know what an integer is, which I have yet to watch a video on, and then I have to do a lab exercise to, to do that. And basically the, the first thing is, um, your first program, the second one's variables and assignments. Uh, next thing I get to learn about is like errors and data types. So we'll we'll see what happens. There's going to be op uh, operations and um, stuff like that, precedence and uh, decision making and program flow, arrays, binary operations, programming structure, STL strings, classes and objects, input process and output. Um, so a lot of this will actually help me with AI as well. I've tried developing my own AI in LaserTag, which I, I don't. I think I posted a video on, but I can't. What's on my YouTube? <laughs> I don't know what's on my own YouTube channel. This is real bad. Uh, and, and like, I keep, I spent, I'm not even joking about this. I spent hours, and I mean it. I spent hours. Um, maybe not, maybe it wasn't hours. It was an hour. I was trying to find, kind of embarrassing. I was trying to find, um, what was it? I was trying to find the, it's really fucking complicated. I was trying to find um, something and I can't remember what that something was apparently. Oh, dark mode. I was trying to find dark mode and it was really hyper complicated, but I want to see, do I, do I have laser tag on here? No, no, I don't. So out of all of the video game development things I've done, laser tag is not one of them. <laughs> what? No, there's no way. Really? Is it seriously only block jumper that's on here? By the way, when I turn 18, get prepared. This is in July, July 7th. So on July 7th, uh, well, maybe not on July 7th, but on July 7th, I turn 18. Um, with that being said, also, we're not going to disclose the fact that my name is now out on the internet because I do racing. Um, so if you watch my Twitch, you know my name now. You don't know how to pronounce it, but you know my name. Um... On July 7th, or, or maybe not on July 7th, maybe a little bit after, once I turn 18, at some point in time, I will be making a Patreon, and I will be uploading some video games for free. So, Block Jumper, for instance, is a game that's already finished. I need to delete a couple of levels because I think it's too much. I think Because the game is super simplistic, 
It really doesn't have uh, a significant purpose. It's just a difficult-ish platforming game. Um, so I'm basically going to be get rid of, getting rid of the... Um, I think it's like the last three or four levels that I made. And then we're essentially just going to upload that on Steam, and then I'll have my Patreon linked in the game. So, and then I'll upload it on Steam. So eventually you guys will be able to support me through Patreon, which means it'll be easier for me to make video games. And also, with that being said, okay, with that being said, I'll also be able to uh, make better games because I'll have money to kind of put into time rather than having to go to work and then not be able to work on my video games. Um, so, so with that being said, I'm going to be doing, yeah. So as soon as I'm, as soon as I graduate high school, I'm going to be doing programming. That's what I'm going to be doing and video games. Um, a lot of them don't expect a lot of 3d games at first. We're working on one major video game, which I have now imported over into a C++ file. Um, well, I can't really say I imported. All the assets are going to be there. However, the code I need to reprogram and redo without the blueprints, primarily with coding. Um, so that's why I'm taking a C++ course right now. And I'll also have to take a Unreal Engine course as well, which Unreal Engine has, so that I know um, certain things, like if I want something to do another thing, then I have to do that, especially with trigger boxes and all. It's going to be a pain in my ass, but I'm looking forward to doing it. I'm looking forward to experiencing this. It's going to be a lot of work, but the reason I'm doing, the reason I'm doing coding in video games is because you can do so much more. There's almost no limitation. Um, the limitation is your imagination, essentially with coding. So hopefully when I learn enough coding, I can make the video game that's already decent much better and continue on that path. Hopefully. That being said, the only game that I really have finished right now is Block Jumper. I would upload the laser tag game, except it's not a finished product. <laughs> it's not a finished product, and it doesn't plan on being a finished product. It was a high school project. Um, and I swore I uploaded a video on it, but I guess I didn't. And that's my bad, I guess. But I... No, I did. I did upload a video on it. What? I totally did upload a video on it. I've uploaded multiple videos on it. It's just not called Laser Tag. Okay. So, uh, hold on. Oh, God, this was a while ago. This was in 2021. Oh, no. This was actually a year ago, almost to the day. Next week, it'll have been exactly a year ago. Um, but, th so, this is the, this is the video game that yeah, I'm talking about. Time. Allergy season's kicking up. Uh, so yeah, I have three levels. Oh, here. pollen. Uh, yeah, that's funny because, uh, at this point in time, a year ago, we had green grass and we had, uh, we, we had pollen and things in the air. Uh, it's snowing <laughs> currently and it's March. So screw that global warming shit, right? No. Uh, so it's snowing right now. So there's literally no pollen in the air. There's no way to get allergies right now other than... Well, not even cut grass because no one's mowing their lawns. But at this point in time, it was green outside. And I had to mow the lawn and there was lots of pollen in the air. So I had allergies like crazy um, because I'm allergic to cut grass specifically. And uh, pollen just makes me sneeze a lot. So, um, yeah, it was allergy season at this point in time. Um, not COVID. <laughs> Which you used to have to say. Now, now it's just like, who fucking cares? <laughs> Uh, first level, you guys should all know this level. This is the level I made on the stream that I made in the video game. If you guys haven't seen that, if you want to see the early development phases of the game, that's where you should go look, because it has been a heck of a ride getting here. So this is the actual only map with AI. Um, not that there's any AI that will shoot you or kill you or... Not the case anymore. Or whatever yet, you're not going to die. You're just going to get shot and be sent into... But this has been completely. developed substantially. Um, there are no AI like that yet. What do exist, however, are these boxes... <laughs> Anyway, this is the first map finished and complete. Uh, we're going to go take a look at that AI right now. Actually, we're going to go and check him out. Oh, is this before I finish the AI? AI? Right now, he's probably just following my location, even though I'm in a completely different room. Because that's what he's told to do currently. Uh, so let's go and give our friend a little greeting. Hello, is this before? Again, my friend. 
Now, let me turn on the, uh, this. Oh, this is so much before. Okay, so this is the same gun I'm holding. Except, there's two things. One, it's a lot lower on me than it should be. It should be... I, I say probably... It should be a bit... This is be a person the unfinished, like, like the unfinished unfinished. Attached to it. So, the only thing it does right now is follow... Like, it, not follow me literally, but it looks at where I am. And this is so I'm long ago. Uh, currently, that is. It, it, it'll get there eventually. Um, but for now, that's, it did. that's kind of it. Now, yeah, so that AI, that AI has evolved substantially from that video. How have I not uploaded a video on that? How have I not uploaded a video? What? I, no, I'm, I'm fascinated now. I feel like... I feel like there should have been a video updating the fact that AI exists in that game now. And it doesn't just follow you around anymore. It, like, it will find other AI and shoot other AI now. Um, that's crazy. That, that, yeah, that was so long ago. That was before I knew how to do AI to its fullest. Um, yeah, that's crazy. That's so long ago. In just one year, that game has upgraded substantially that's that's great and, and you know what it, i haven't even been working on it for the full year so that's even that's even better is this elite dangerous why why is it called satisfactory if it's elite Here, dangerous to check out how everything's looking and then I oh because i went to elite dangerous okay never mind um yeah so anyway video game development super fun i love it it honestly it, it's one of the best things that i could do one it requires a lot of logical thinking especially with coding um and two it also lets me uh, embrace my creative side as well so i get to build a world um i get to build a world i get to put whatever i want into it and then i can just continue from there and i absolutely love that i can do that it is possibly one of my favorite things about video game development is the fact that I can come up with an idea, I can code it, I can implement it, and then it's there. Um, that is literally why I love video games in itself so much, because you can express, especially sandbox games, you can express your creativity in a way that not many, or, or not all games will let you do. But now, knowing how to do video game development, I can express my creative ideas more than anything would ever let me do. So it's fantastic. I love doing it. Um, but like I said, yeah, I'm trying to work on becoming uh, healthier. So I'm doing intermittent fasting, um, which means there'll be a lot of leftovers in my fridge because <laughs> I won't be eating. Um, but on an added note, I'll be working out with that as well. And um, yeah, just going on more walks. I, I'm really, right now, trying to improve my health. Not only will going on walks and things help my mental health, which is super important to me, um, I will now be able to go meet with friends, do all that kind of stuff, work out, do all these things uh, that I really should be doing and really want to do. And I think it'll be a massive improvement on my life. Um, hopefully, I'll be drinking a significant amount of water. I'll probably start filling up my uh, gallon water bottle again and filling it with uh, ice because I can't drink warm water. It just, I, I don't know what it is. I can't drink it. Um, I, I drink it at a push. Like, if, it's, if I desperately need something to drink, I'll drink warm water, but I, I can't do it otherwise. So, probably be filling it up with ice since it keeps uh, water cool real well. Um, but yeah, so it should be great. Anyway. That's what's going on in my life right now. I'm sorry I haven't been uploading a lot. I know I played a lot of Icarus, and I do have videos uh, for Icarus. I just, I, I'm, I'm really sorry about my really terrible upload schedule right now. I, I honestly am. I have just been so busy doing other things and trying to um, kind of live my life and trying to get ready for the next step of my life as well. So, once again, super sorry about all of this about the lack of uploading all of that super sorry about it i'm back hopefully we'll see what happens we'll see how busy i get we'll see how stressful my life gets but there's an update on my life i'm super sorry i haven't been uploading i have videos ready to upload it's just been i've been so busy that i keep forgetting to do it um so essentially expect to see some videos 
expect to see videos get uploaded and hopefully it won't take too long hopefully i say hopefully because i, I really don't know uh hopefully it won't take too long to get them uploaded and yeah so anyway with that being said i have to go charge my wireless headset um for the walk and it's not really a headset it's like an earpiece thing that i can listen to music on and still hear everything else around me so i'm going to go get that charged for my walk and then i'm going to go on my walk and then i'm going to come back and then hopefully it won't be super late so i can do another recording of a thing that i want to do and then yeah so anyway i'm all over the place that's what i'm trying to say i'm all over the place sorry for the upload schedule i'm sorry i've been gone i'm back now yay um so that's the plan yeah i plan on I, i'm basically trying to take care of myself right now that's that's what i'm trying to do um I was about to say I hope that doesn't make any of you angry, but if it makes you angry, go fuck yourself, because I'm more important than my YouTube channel. Without me, the YouTube channel doesn't exist. So, yeah. Um, yeah, I just plan on working out and doing all that stuff. It should be a good time. Anyway, with that being said, hope you guys all enjoyed. I'll see you all later. Goodbye.